Mastering the Art of Happiness, Ancient Philosophical Secrets Revealed. Welcome to a journey of enlightenment, as we delve into the mysteries of ancient philosophical secrets to mastering the art of happiness. Have you ever wondered what it takes to be truly happy? The answers may have been hiding in plain sight. Let's start with the ancient Greeks, who gave us the concept of eudaimonia. It's more than just fleeting happiness. Eudaimonia is about flourishing, about leading a good life. It's about personal growth and self-realization. Then there's the Stoic philosophy. The Stoics believed happiness couldn't be found in external circumstances, but rather, within ourselves. They taught that we should focus on what we can control, and let go of what we can't. The Buddhists, on the other hand, propose a different approach. They suggest that happiness comes from letting go of desire. By learning to accept the impermanence of life, we can free ourselves from the chains of discontent. In the heart of Eastern philosophy, Confucius emphasized the importance of harmony in achieving happiness. Harmony with the self, with others, and with nature. It's about finding balance and aligning ourselves with the rhythms of the universe. Another ancient philosophy comes from the Hindu tradition, the principle of Dharma. It's about finding your purpose, your duty, and fulfilling it. It's about recognizing your place in the grand scheme of things, and playing your part to the best of your ability. The Epicureans, contrary to popular belief, didn't advocate for mindless pleasure-seeking. Instead, they preached the pursuit of simple, sustainable pleasures, the ones that lead to peace of mind and absence of pain, the truest form of happiness. In the realm of Taoism, happiness is a state of flow. It's about going with the flow of life, not resisting it. It's about finding your path, your Tao, and walking it with acceptance and peace. Lastly, let's not forget about the philosophy of Carpe Diem. This ancient Roman philosophy promotes seizing the day, living in the moment, and savoring every bit of life. It's about appreciating the here and now. These ancient philosophical secrets are not just about achieving happiness. They are about mastering it, about making it a state of being. They are about understanding that happiness is not a destination, but a journey. And now, these secrets are in your hands, waiting to be understood and practiced. Remember, it's not just about knowing these secrets. It's about living them. So, start today and master the art of happiness, one philosophical secret at a time. In conclusion, while the paths to happiness vary, they all lead to the same destination, a state of contentment, peace, and fulfillment. They all teach us that true happiness can't be found outside but within. So, no matter which philosophy resonates with you, the key is to start practicing. After all, mastering the art of happiness isn't a one-time event but a lifelong journey. So, why not start today? Embrace these ancient philosophical secrets and make happiness your way of life. Thank you for joining us on this enlightening journey. We hope that these ancient philosophical secrets will guide you towards a happier, more fulfilled life. Because, at the end of the day, happiness is not just an emotion. It is an art, an art that can be mastered, 